Turkey's prime minister said earlier on Saturday that the situation is completely under control, describing the coup attempt as a black stain on Turkey's democracy. Reports say at least 194 people were killed. It said that about 2,800 people had been rounded up, including those who formed the backbone of the rebellion. Authorities also ordered the detention of thousands of prosecutors and judges. Thousands of protesters gathered Saturday in Istanbul, Ankara, and Izmir to protest the coup attempt. Meanwhile, Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan reiterated a call for his U.S. counterpart Barack Obama to hand over the U.S.-based Islamic cleric Fethullah Gulen, who is accused of being behind the coup attempt. The Pentagon said Turkish officials have closed the airspace around the Turkish air base from which the U.S.-led coalition launched airstrikes against the Islamic State. Turkey is a NATO ally for the United States and part of the U.S.-led coalition to fight IS.